hey you guys and welcome back to my channel pisces soul tribe what's up you guys hopefully you guys have been doing well today i'm back with another message for you guys because like i feel like there's this there's something um that's here and honestly this will be a general read and i'm just gonna let you know spirit do his thing but I don't know. Like, I, I feel like there's something that you guys need to know. So let's see what message um, Spirit has for us. Spirit of the Most High, angels, ancestors, ascended masters, um, higher beings, messages for um, the Pisces soul tribe. Um, we bind and cancel up any negative attacks and we return those attacks to the sender um, tenfold so that we may continue to be edified, uplift uplifted and encouraged so Pisces I wonder let's see what this is about up oh, we got the the two of cups at the bottom of the deck so I'm getting a sense of partnership not necessarily love it doesn't always have to be love you know love for you know intimately kind of love but I do I do get a sense of you know you might be having some um, partnerships um, incoming but let's let's get some moon manifestation what's this oh no it's four reflect on your priorities um go deeper um I, I, yeah i would definitely say that's probably a good one spirit what you got for us okay up oh, forgive hmm what else spirit Mm. step up and lead new moon and capricorn and that forgive was a full moon in um pisces so pisces um could be um, pisces to pisces relationship could be significant um we do have capricorn um here as well spirit what else okay ah make time for self-love so i'm definitely getting a sense of some introspection that that does need to happen but like as always um self-love is de um, definitely important because honestly if you don't have that real love for you how you gonna have you know love for somebody else and then that's last quarter moon and libra so we have water we have um earth and then we have air um, know you are loved is also um, at the bottom of the deck. So that's last quarter moon in Libra for make time for self love, and then new moon in Libra um, for know you are loved. So I feel like there's some affirming that that needs to happen here, and I'm also getting a sense of somebody, and all due respect, um, somebody doesn't love themselves as much as they should spirit and i'm not saying you don't have love for yourself but i'm saying you could have more love for yourself so that you can open up to love somebody else spirit one more okay know your worth like so there is uh what is that new moon in taurus so there is definitely a strong message here about self-love and then with that love knowing knowing your work but with um also forgive here somebody's holding on to something step into your power yeah somebody's holding on to something and i feel like that's something that you're holding on to is probably the reason why um you're in this space where it's, where spirit is telling us that you need to make time for self-love and know your worth but i'm also getting a sense of somebody who sacrifices themselves um at the at the risk in the hands of somebody else somebody is a yeah yeah with the four swords at the bottom of of, of the deck spirit what message do you have that correlates with the moon manifestation oracle cards uh the four of wands came out in reverse you guys somebody is is stuck 
somebody is stuck and I, I was just talking about that in in the message from earlier spirit what else yep um five of wands petty arguments competition fighting multiple individuals spirit what else but we do have the six of swords incoming so this is definitely giving me somebody who's moving away from something moving away from some sort of conflict moving from from away away from some sort of strife with the seven of swords at the bottom of the deck so i feel like you're moving away from secrets and lies spirit what else yeah you're moving on to the ace of cups you're moving on to a new new love but i'm also getting a sense this that this may not be um a love for somebody else but i'm getting a sense that this is an overflowing love for yourself because i'm getting a sense that somebody move moving to a space where instead of giving their love to someone else you turned it inward mm. spirit what is the four of wands in reverse because something ain't over or something at some point in time wasn't over and you were stuck. I don't know. I'm just getting a sense of somebody who was stuck in a cycle for uh, quite a few years. Yeah, the, the three, the three of wands, like. Somebody stuck it out like somebody stuck something out for, for quite some time. And I don't know why I'm getting the sense of three of wands being three years. But like you didn't have any success with it. There were there were no major milestones with this. It was just I, honestly, I'm just getting a sense of something, something stagnant because the three of wands is also watching like you. You're watching your ships coming in, but you ain't move. You're not moving. Spirit, what else? What's the three of wands? Hmm. I'm, I'll take it um, The five of swords So somebody just wanted to keep you in a space Where honestly They would just continually and continually um, Have you in a defeatist mentality And like honestly In this particular In this particular set um, Nobody is winning So like I said Like it's just like Okay are we going to be stuck in this cycle Because you do something to me I do something to you And what you do to me, you may consider worse. What I may do to you, you consider worse. So we're stuck in this game of, of hopscotch, but we hopping on two feet and we're not really doing anything. Spirit, what's the... F the number five could be very um, significant. I, you know, I don't know why, but the number five is very significant for somebody. Spirit, what's the five of swords? The Five of Swords is the Queen of Wands um, in reverse. Um, so this is definitely somebody who was all about themselves. Um, they were they were obsessive. Um, I'm getting a sense of somebody who was real petty. Um, somebody who was, you know, just all about me. Pick me, pick me. Um, I'm also getting a sense of somebody who, you know, might be a little, you know, a hoe. But I'm going to leave that alone too. Spirit, what's the um, Queen of Wands in reverse? I'm sorry, y'all. Whoever this is. Okay. I, Spirit, that's too many. Yeah, that's way too many. Spirit, Queen of Wands in reverse. Can I have one? That's too many, Lord. Can I have one? <laughs> I know this is a large story. Yeah. Um, The Justice. Um, I feel like at some point in time, um, something was also, um, something needed to be balanced. 
something definitely needed to be balanced but i'm also getting a sense of somebody who possibly had to go to court and i'm getting a sense of somebody who maybe had to get like a restraining order because like i'm getting a sense of of somebody who was stuck in a relationship with somebody who was very obsessive and obsessive to the point um where you felt like you may have been may be in danger i'm not trying to trigger anybody i promise i'm not i'm only reading the cards but i'm also getting a sense of somebody who 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 has to go who who has to go to court be, to defend themselves and that's very interesting because in this particular deck um the queen of the queen of wands is the public defender um spirit what else can i get one more what 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 is the justice yeah balancing out the justice is a, is, is a sense of success because like i feel like this is something that you moved away from you made the right decision and i feel like that is the reason why you you possibly do need to forgive this situation I, and le believe me it's like you want me to forgive this treacherous motherfucker because i mean i am getting a sense and a feel of somebody who was treacherous and the old me would be like fuck that you know fuck them like you know I will say that, but then you're stuck in a rut where you will still have somebody seeming as if they may have some power over you because you you're holding back some sense of forgiveness. Now, granted, forgiveness, most people say is for you. But like, I also feel like when you forgive somebody else, it releases that away from you as well. Spirit, what's the five of sword? Five of wands. Yeah, the number five is very significant here. Um, the number, um, number five, <laughs> the five of wands, um, is the empress. But why are we fighting? Why are we fighting with the empress? What's the conflict? I feel like that spirit. What's the conflict? What, what, what's the empress here for spirit? The magician. Okay, before I speak, um, what's the magician spirit? Uh, somebody manifesting a baby. And like, I feel, I feel like that was the conflict. Somebody didn't want to be a parent. Yeah, I'm I'm get, I'm getting a sense of that that is the conflict. Like I feel like there may it may have been possible where someone may have had a conflict. I feel like this is a deal breaker. I'm definitely feeling like this is a deal breaker or okay no spirit what's the ace of wands yeah somebody's definitely manifesting a baby okay that was a bit aggressive uh the chariot with the star at the bottom of the deck Somebody wanted a happy ending. Like somebody was was the conflict is somebody was manifesting their happy ending. A baby, the ace of the empress to the magician to the ace of wands. Yeah, somebody somebody wanted a baby. Spirit and what's the what's the chariot? I feel like you had to move away from this ideology. the three of, of pentacles or three of coins like I feel like you moved into a space of a different collaboration like I do feel like you moved on because I, I feel like that was a deal breaker somebody didn't want a baby but like I feel like you you're manifesting what it is you really truly want like the eight of cups is at the bottom of the deck like somebody walked away from it and what's the three of cups spirit? Uh, three of pentacles three of pentacles spirit yeah somebody works better alone and like i'm i feel like that's that i feel like that's what happened like, I feel like, not that you manifested a baby, a baby was born here. 
a baby was definitely born here and i'm also getting a sense of honestly you you went to the hospital you did you went to the hospital let's just and you know just the way my mind works let's just say the three of pentacles in this imagery is the hospital in is the hospital and the hermit is about introspection but you do that alone i'm getting a sense of somebody who got into some form of collaboration with somebody who did not want a baby and you found out that you were pregnant and in versus you doing the other thing you decided that you wanted to have the baby and like i feel like you did you did that all alone and I feel like this was the place where you did have to step up and lead like you had to do it um, by yourself. And like I, I do get a sense of you being successful with it, but it's definitely um, not a, it's not an easy thing. It's definitely not an easy thing. And it, which brings us to the six of swords like you you moved on to a different space and spirit what's the six of swords what did we move on to what's the six of swords spirit the death but it was in reverse it was definitely in reverse uh i feel like somebody is 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 fighting some sense of of, of change some sense of coming back to life and actually I'm honestly getting a sense of the towers at the bottom of the deck I'm getting a sense of, of some kind of um, depressive nature I don't know why but that's what I'm getting a sense of spirit what's the what's the death in reverse yeah I feel like it possibly puts you um, the death is the death in reverse is the high priestess and spirit. What's the high priestess? I feel like this is something, you know, you need to do like, you know, you need to do it, but you're fighting it. Spirit, what's the what's the high priestess? See, it, it's, it's the ace of swords you know you need to do this like you you know you need to change and like i feel like that's what the ace ace of swords is coming in for like let's go let's let's you this idea your move uh, travel is also significant here like i feel like you know you need to do this and it's time for you to you do it like it's time for you to do it time for you to speak up time for you to honestly say it out loud to yourself or maybe you need to say it out loud this is stupid but out loud inward you know spirit what's the ace of swords But as I said, like, I know this is the two of cups, but I feel like somebody knows that they need to love themselves a little more. Somebody knows that 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 they need to make time to make time for them, make time to heal, make time to make time to make time for self-love. And it's interesting that the last quarter moon is in Libra with the ace of swords to the two of cups like I feel like there's something that you need to you, somebody needs an affirmation and yes they do help somebody needs to look in the mirror there we go somebody needs to look in the mirror and say I love you and I feel like that's the inspiration with the ace of swords to the two of cups like go stand in a mirror and tell yourself you love you that you forgive yourself for putting up with some nonsense you forgive yourself for not loving you more. Spirit, two of cups. Yeah. The judgment to the to the ace of pentacles. Like, I feel like there's a new start that is waiting for you. But like I feel like in order for that to happen, you have to make time to heal and love on you more. And then the ace of discs to the ace of cups. Spirit, what's the what's the ace of cups? 
you have the Ace of Wands out here. You have the Ace of Disc out here. You also have the Ace of Cups. Spirit, can I have one? What's the Ace of Cups? Okay, he gave me two. So I, I'm just going to go ahead and take it. Yeah, the Ace of Cups is the Three of Swords to the Six of, 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 of Wands. Like, something was painful. I get it. Like, something was painful. Believe me, I get it. But I feel like when you when you make a conscious decision that you want to heal after you heal, you will have success. You will have what it is you want and you will have what it is you want because you made room. You integrated your shadows. I cannot I cannot emphasize enough the importance of integrating your shadows integrating your shadows make things beneficial for you and then what we view as an affirmity can actually be a, be the thing that comes to strengthen you spirit what's the six of wands i feel like it yeah when you know that when you do that you you do know your worth you do know your worth um prince of cups I feel like it's time to let go of illusion. Honestly, I like I feel I feel like it's time to let go of illusion and it's time to change with the two of pentacles at the bottom of, of, of the deck. Like, I feel like it's just just time to let go of these illusions that, you know, things are are what they seem and they're not really what they seem. Um, it's time to let go of a false ideology. Honestly, spirit, what's the Prince of Cups? Who is this, Prince of Cups? Because I honestly, I don't feel like he's really offering anything. Well, I could be wrong, though. It's the lovers. And maybe, maybe fantasy is what you need. Real, realistic fantasy, attainable fantasy. I feel like you're looking for that type of romance that you will find in a movie. Spirit, what's the lovers? Okay. The lovers is the nine of cups. So you need to love yourself because that's that that's really what it is. Like the nine of cups, that's that's single. Like that's that's happy on your own. But like I feel like there is also an abundance waiting for you. But you you're putting your time back in, in family. You're putting your time back in you. I swear to God, every time I, I get close to something that even looks like a love reading it just turns into self-love and it turns into love for for your craft and love for your dreams and your and your ideas with the um hierophant um at the bottom of the deck spirit what's the nine of cups and then we can get out of here you guys i want to thank you guys so much for supporting me for being here I know some of y'all patience is like real low. The devil. I feel you know the devil just has the tendency um, to show show its face, and honestly, I'm getting a sense of some some toxic cycle trying to repeat itself. But like I feel like you remain in this space where you're working on yourself with the eight of pentacles at the bottom of the deck. So honestly, I wouldn't even worry about the devil. The devil's just showing his face as as he always does. But continue to work on yourself, Pisces. Continue to master yourself. Continue to to know your worth. Know your worth. Know your worth. I'm curious though. I am so curious. <sighs> okay, y'all. What's the devil, Lord? Yeah, lustful desires. Um, the Knight of Cups. I feel like you have somebody who's trying to enter back into your energy with this nonsense. And I'll be totally honest with you guys. It feel it does feel very toxic. It does. It feel it feel it reeks of toxicity. And honestly, I feel like that's the place you're trying to move forward from. Ain't nobody trying to do all of that. Yeah, see? Walk away. The Ace of Cups is still at the eight Ace. The Eight of Cups is at the bottom of the deck. Letting letting you know that ain't it. Cause it and and you know what? That's the way it always goes. When you get into a place where you're happy, nine of cups. 
here come that here comes the devil we know always to present to you something that you don't even really truly want anymore and that's the reason why you ended this cycle but you guys that's the read um hopefully in some capacity this resonates with someone on some level um of course if the if it doesn't resonate on all levels do not take what doesn't resonate um use your discernment um and use your intuition to make the details fit as they are supposed to pisces soul tribe Thank you so much for the likes, the shares, the comments, the su su for subscribing, and for your support. Um, anything you need from me will be down below in the description box. Pisces Soul Tribe. Enjoy the rest of your day, guys. Bye.